everybody, welcome back to Rod's Reviews and Demos. I got a couple $150 party speakers here, Bluetooth party speakers. Uh, I have the Dolphin, this is the uh, 210 RBT, and I have the Pile 1035A. This one is generally sold on, at Walmart, I think you can get it at Amazon, 150 bucks. Uh, this guy I got from 310 Audio. It's also 150 bucks. So I played with both of them a little bit. Now I've actually done a couple of reviews on the Dolphin, and for 150 bucks, it's a great speaker. So I decided to keep this guy, and that way I have a benchmark for un other speakers of similar value. Uh, so you got two 3-inch tweeters, two 10-inch woofers on both speakers. They go for the same price. They basically have the same options on them. This guy has a seven band onboard equalizer. And this guy here has a five band onboard equalizer. Both of them have radios with antennas. Uh, this guy has a battery. The pile does not. So let's get on with the music. Um, I'm going to get out of the picture here and I'll move the camera back and forth between the speakers I'm playing so you guys know what's playing. I have all the levels flat. I have the EQs flat. Uh, bass and treble is all flat on those speakers. Uh, I'm going to set it to flat on my phone as well. And today's cocktail of the day is a mudslide. These are the Chi Chi's pre-mix mudslides. They are delicious. Very easy to drink. So this is more like, uh, this is going to be like a sound quality test. Is the clarity good? Does it sound nice? Uh, we're going to play everything flat. It does sound good, uh, nice and crisp, there's no breaking up there, no uh, distortion at all, it adds volume. Okay, so next up here is the pile. So actually, I think the pile sounds pretty good at 50% volume with everything flat.
match. I think they're pretty comparable, uh, the two speakers. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and go full blast. <laughs> Okay, so it seems to me that the pile is a lot louder and it has better clarity. The Dolphin seems to have a little lower lows on it, but it's nowhere near as loud. Uh, it does have a battery though, so that kind of makes up, makes up for some of that. Um, it's definitely more stylish looking too. The, uh, the pile is pretty ugly. My girl says it looks like there's hubcaps on it. So that concludes the $150 Bluetooth party speaker battle. Uh, I think that the speakers are pretty evenly matched up. Uh, you definitely get more volume out of the pile. It's a little louder. And I think the clarity's a touch better on the pile than the Dolphin. But the pile doesn't have a battery. The Dolphin does. So, you know, it all depends what you're looking for. You want portability. Uh, the Dolphin's probably the way to go. If, if you don't need portability, the, the pile definitely is louder and sounds better. That said, though, with the equalized, with the bass turned up on both speakers, I had more distortion out of the pile than I did the Dolphin. But the pile's a lot louder too, so I guess that's kind of expected. Um, they're both decent speakers. For 150 bucks, you know, I, I, I think they're both worth it. I think they're a decent value for $150. Uh, again, I appreciate y'all watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Cheers. Yeah.